Yo, I want to welcome all y'all to the best Madden 19 tips and trips channel where you will be able to dominate on offense, send the fast blitzes on defense, make your opponent rage quit and send you nasty messages or either beg for you to quit out the game. I also do custom schemes if you play regs, so hit your boy up, follow the link in the description to get all the ebooks and you will become an exclusive member. Welcome to the Clamp Squad. What's up gamers? Welcome back to another Madden 19 tip video. Today we're going to go over a couple key coin making methods that help me out. Now if you look at the top of the screen, I got an 88 overall with 147,000 coins. The reason for that is because last night at around 10 o'clock before the gifts in the new Zero Chill Ghost Madden promo, I sold off all the players on my team that I didn't need. So I took about 1.4 million coins and then I invested them into snow and gifts. So from what I pulled last night, I invested about 1.3, 1.4 million coins and in return, I should have about 3.9 to 5.5 million coins coming back by Friday or Saturday. So I don't follow what the rest of the YouTubers are talking about because that's their job. One thing you got to do is be smart. The number one key is solo challenges and solo battles. Now I don't do the solo battles. I let my son play around with the solo battles, but the solo challenges, any kind of free rewards as far as training, coins, anything that you can get for free, that's what you need to concentrate on. Not buying all these hundred thousand hundred dollar bundles trying to get the newest flashes cards because these cards will depreciate and if you start getting into the habit of spending money which won't mean anything in not even three or four months you have to start all the way back over from fresh so I'm just gonna give you a reality check on how to be smart how to be disciplined and be able to stack coins in Madden so a lot of youtubers are saying the snow is gonna depreciate if you have 92, 93 overall cards on your team and you want the newest and the greatest, just sell them before they drop all the way down because we don't know what's going to come for the New Year's. It might be 7, it might be 9 new 96 overall. So your cards today, that's 92 overall, that's probably 160, 170k, by that time will go down to about 99 to 105 K so you have been the lost value in that but it's nothing that you need to just rush and do it's something that you need to do if you have a plan as far as switching it over to snow uh, getting ghost of Madden past ghost of Madden present which them cards at the New Year's will all go down too so if you get them now a smart way without spending real money then you can sell them off while they are at a, at a high point and you can make a profit so we're going to go over my presence on what I did. We're going to look at my team. And if you've been following anybody on Twitter or anything like that, you can see these are my top cards that I have left. And these are not cards that I'm able to buy with money. This is the Mutt Master. This is the uh, net card that I boosted up because I'm a Lions fan. Then we got the net. We got the net. This is what they just gave us and him. Now, anybody else that I had up there, I sold them. I got rid of them last night. So I powered down Matt Stafford, I got the Rookie Premier, Rookie Pre uh, Rising Stars, all these type of cards is what I'm left with. Now I will be able to get the newest and greatest without having to spend money on the Christmas promo because of the gifts. So when you go into the Zero Chill and then you go into Elite, you can see I got 94 Elites, 60 Golds. So I invested 1.3 to 1.4 million coins. And in return, I'm going to turn that into 3.5 to 5 million, depending on what the value is. So if a 95 or 96 come out like the Nadama Sus and all that type of stuff, he was sitting at about 530 to 600,000 coins. So I always think in my head, they just dropped a 93 today. So in my head, I always think it could be between 250,000 up to 600,000. So I think at the lowest... So we're going to go into Ascending right here. So we're going to go into Ascending. So the 27th, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of these medium green packages. These are all medium presents. So this can be 87 overalls, 89 overalls, or 90 overalls. Now today, the market is starting to go down. So this can be 30,000 up to 115,000. 
So you'd be 30, 60, 90, 120, 150, 180, 210, 240. Plus I have this big box that can be, like I said, it can be a 95, it can be a 93, it can be a 96. So that'd be 250 or 300,000 up to 600,000, 650,000, depending on what it is. So tomorrow I will make possibly about 600,000 out of my 1.3 million investment. So then the 27th, which is be the day after, I got all these small bits, all these small gifts on the 28th. All these, and then I have one, two, three, four large, and then one extra large. So my money is made back already, plus some from this part right here. My money is made back plus some from the 28th. So just be impatient, and in two days, not going out and trying to do stupid stuff and spend money to get the newest and the shiniest cards not trying to copy youtubers and do what they do which is their job I'm about breaking even or up already it could be 250 300,000 or 600,000 from these medium gifts from these large gifts or the extra largest now on the 29th I'm able to build my team already from the 29th all these small ones could be 8,000 for the small ones up to 15,000 and then I have one two three Four of the large ones they could be 250,000 or they can be a pass which would be 500 600,000 so that would be 250 5 255 that could be a million already from four gifts and then all these small ones that can still turn to snow or these can be 500 1 million 500 1 million that'd be 2 million that I made off of four gifts so that would be over my investment back plus another 1.5 or 2 million here to be able to build my team then I go down when I got all these medium gifts that can be 87 overalls or 90 overalls just by being patient and then I have all these that people are saying might be the Pittsburgh Steelers wide receiver that can be 70,000 to 120,000 so this is all profit after this this is all profit I'm able to go in build my team and compete more now I've been competing with a 91 overall a lot of people are sitting at 94 95 96 overalls already from spending money you got to be smarter than that you got to think real life situations now I would rather instead of buying a hundred and dollar bundle a hundred and fifty dollar bundle go buy my son a PS4 for two hundred some dollars something that's gonna mean anything in the next three to four months and that's how I want y'all to be smart too so out of 1.3 1.4 million coins I'm probably gonna make 3.5 up to 5 million coins back and then I will invest that into my newer and improved team without having to go into my wallet and spend real money so the key is just be patient have some discipline you can watch other videos don't try to copy exactly what they do because that is their job your job is to be smart and have fun with the game you can win with a 90 91 overall team if you have the right type of scheme or if you have my top 50 to 100 weekend league ebook that will help you out with 90 91s it don't matter so if this helped you out drop a like on the video is more madden 19 tips like this on the way i appreciate y'all let's go